Hey guys, Edog Place here, bringing you guys another video. Today we're hopping back on Idle Miner for part 122. Guys, if you do want to see more of this series, because I don't post very much of it right now, go ahead and smash that like button and leave a comment down below letting me know if you guys want to continue seeing this series. It is an absolute amazing series, and I would love to keep playing it if you guys want to see more. Let me know. But we are on part 122, and honestly, guys, I was going to make a merge plane video today. I hopped on, started recording as normal. And it didn't give us our offline earnings that is just it's such an annoying glitch so i was like i don't even want to deal with merch plans today we're gonna to hop on idol miner let's get to it so right off the bat as you guys can see we have earned 7.23 aa from being away for 12 days and 21 hours or sorry 13 days 21 hours so we've been away for a really long time this is the idle dawn cash um so we'll go ahead and collect that you know what i Honestly, I don't really want to deal with this area either. What I want to play right now, I just, I had a craving and I really, really wanted to, actually, well, first, let's go ahead and get this started. Let's just activate my managers here. Um, let's unlock the new mine shafts, but I want to go ahead and play mainland because mainland is how you get more super managers and stuff like that. It's not a waste of time or anything. It's just a lot of fun. There we go. So we, do, we still don't have any legendary guys or executive guys i should say uh which really really sucks as you can see here though we are my or total warehouse is 276 billion total extractors 496 and we are mining 1.44 trillion uh so we need to put a lot of upgrades into that still i don't think we'll be able to oh once we upgrade the warehouse like 10 times then we should be good on that end um let's do a couple upgrades here actually that should be good it's not still it's really really close, but it's still not quite good enough But once we go ahead and get this kind of settled I will go ahead and hop over to mainland because we haven't played mainland in a super long time So I'm kind of excited to go check that out um, and progress there for a little bit Go ahead and do one more upgrade there Okay, it's close enough honestly We'll just leave it for right now and we'll go ahead and hop over to mainland just because getting the new super managers was really, really good. I will go ahead and the enter the mine. I don't know if we've started one or what. Okay, so 41.2 AN, uh, 42.5, 20 days and 20 hours since we've played this. Let's go ahead and activate some boost. Which ones? 10 times it come for 5 minutes. Let's go ahead and activate that. Uh, what other ones? We don't have many. We have 20 times it come for 5 minutes. Let's use 2 of those. So... This is going to be a big, big start. 30 times income for 5 minutes. Let's go ahead and let's get everything going here. Let's try to complete this mine as quick as we possibly can. So in mainland, the, our one super manager is just absolutely amazing. It's definitely the best one. Um, I'll show you which one that is specifically. 500. You know what? I don't even care anymore. Let's go ahead and keep purchasing wow guys i think we're actually gonna make it all the way to the bottom so we should be able to complete this mine today so let's go like this super manager 10 times cash every five seconds assign this guy and just keep clicking max we want to do as many upgrades to this guy as we possibly can as you guys can see we did 34 upgrades there now we did 34 upgrades again this is Taking into consideration, this is our best mineshaft, 42 upgrades. We were so far behind where we are right now. So our elevator, ele elevators and everything like that can't handle it. And the amount of money we are making right now is just ridiculous. Especially because that 30 times boost we currently have activated is helping just so much. But let's try to max this mineshaft out because this is obviously going to be the, mo the most profitable mineshaft once it's maxed out uh, by quite a bit actually. So if we max this out max out our elevators everything like that we are going to be in a very very good position trust me so honestly yeah we might be able to complete this mine shaft today it might be a little difficult uh, but they only go to 800 i believe so this should be wearing off soon we'll probably get one more here and it will be done another 45 upgrades we only need 97 more upgrades here sounds like a lot but it really isn't minus 80 percent upgrade cost there See, the thing is, we don't have much money, so that doesn't really help us. Um, so let's go like this, and we need to do... That's 150 upgrades. Another 50 there. That's 200 upgrades. 250. 250. 300. 300 total upgrades. Let's see. Is it enough, though? 
Wow, no, we are still very, very far behind. Another 100 there. Another 100 there. Honestly, our money is not draining at all. Oh, my goodness. Our money is just... It's not moving. Okay. I probably spent a little too much, but let's just max that out there. Level 2,211 on both of those guys there. While we kind of wait for that to catch up, let's go ahead and get this. Our daily reward is an epic chest. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Then, oh, we did get something new here. 3.8. Uh, 3 is actually technically our best one because we are getting times 1.1 global income and three times transportation to the warehouse uh, so we're getting kind of an added bonus for using a legendary guy so that's kind of why i've been using him um, over someone with a higher boost rate if we go ahead and collect this if it'll ever load don't know why it's taking so long here there we go so one h insta cash item 30 m insta cash item 12 super cash Something went wrong. Please make sure you have an active internet connection. I do have an activate active internet connection. Uh, okay, I don't know what's going on with that. Can I actually? Maybe I'll be able to do it and collect it again. No, but I just okay, whatever. I can't redo one, which sucks. But we'll go back to our mine, enter the mine shaft here, and go ahead and upgrade another 44 times. There we go. So we have 200. Well, 1.41 aw. Uh, yeah, so we need to actually we shouldn't have spent that money there We should have upgraded these guys a little bit more do another 50 upgrades 50 upgrades We still have our 30 times income boost for still another minute So we should be able to get a ton of upgrades done here um, Before that runs out and I kind of want to focus as much as I can on our elevator and transporters and stuff like that um just because right now that's what we can't handle we're slacking um, that's what's actually holding us back is this av 141 av so now we can go ahead and upgrade down here let's go ahead and max it out level 800 this is completely maxed out so now i want to go ahead and do another 50 upgrades there another 50 there Ooh, do another 50 just to hit that max level hit the max level there we go so now we go here max that out this is kind of like the annoying part almost because it just takes so long so now we're just going down and maxing out all these mine shafts we're gonna get a ton of gems from this and honestly like i'm thinking of just kind of leaving the dawn mine because it i wanted to play it because it's a brand new mine it's a brand new area but i think this is almost smarter because this is a lot more fun to be honest we are getting super managers which help a lot we wouldn't have been able to do that this without that super manager that i have and there's just so many mine shafts that we have to complete for this, uh, for the mainland mine. So it's not like this is just going to be a couple episode thing. This is going to take a while to get everything maxed out. So honestly, I think from now on, from when we actually play this, let's go ahead and stick to the mainland. Uh, yes, it's kind of not the main part of the game, but it is just so much fun. There we go. Keep maxing these out. As I said, it's kind of like the annoying part. But there we go. We'll go ahead and end the mine. We have completed everything there. The Coast to Medium Mine Shaft. 235 green gems and 58 blue ones. We'll go ahead and end the mine because we completed absolutely everything we could there. Um, there was literally nothing else to do. 235 gems and 58 gems and one star. Perfect. So now we'll go ahead and purchase this one here. The Coast 3 Mine Shaft. We'll go ahead and start that in a second, but I do want to go ahead, didn't want to go there. I want to go ahead and see our super managers. So we need 19,000 of them. We are far from that. So we can actually level these guys up. Okay. So minus 90% upgrade cost. So we can upgrade that one or five times mining and five times walking speed boost. That one's really good. I wish we could level up this one. This one is absolutely amazing. It would increase it by a little bit, uh, but I'm just going to go ahead and save those gems for right now and go ahead and continue the mainland and start the next mine. Oh, it's just, it's so exciting to do this. Honestly, mainland is so good. I could honestly play this for hours and hours on end. And I, honestly, I kind of want to do a live stream of this. I think this would be really, really fun to do a live stream of this. So it's telling me to collect, but I can't. Um, let me know if you guys actually want to see an idle miner live stream. I think it would honestly this would be such a fun game to live stream Merge planes you can kind of play for a little while then it's just like you have to watch ads to keep it um, to 
keep earning money and stuff like that. Uh, for this, it's like, especially, especially for mainland, it is just, it's absolutely amazing. So let's go ahead and purchase a manager there, purchase manager there, and purchase one there. So now everything is doing it on its own. It's working by itself. Um, so that is very, very good. Go ahead and do a couple upgrades here. As you can see, 112, and then we can handle 288 and 341. So we need to upgrade our mine shaft here. Not anymore. Uh, but I do want to kind of focus at the beginning. It's good to focus on your managers. I, it sounds weird, um, but once you get a good manager like this guy, we'll go ahead and assign there. Usually for these ones, I don't know why, but it's so common to find one uh, executive super manager right at the very beginning and then like never again. I don't know why that is. And that's only for the elevator and um, what's it called? Elevator and transporters. I don't know why that is, but that just seems to be a common case. Go ahead and do as many upgrades here as we can. Next mine shaft already. Like, it's just, it's so fast paced, and I think that's why I absolutely love it. Do a couple more upgrades there. Five times walk in speed boost. Might as well activate it. We're going to be on the next mine shaft in like no time, so it doesn't really matter. Um, okay, we are being held back a lot by this our elevators and warehouse. So we'll have to do at least a level five here on these guys there we go so we got the both the level 5 2.16 thousand 1.92 we're extracting 4.59 thousand so we're still quite far behind here but honestly like i said doesn't take too long once we get the both to level oh, level 10 for the transporter it gets a boost level 20 for the elevator gets a boost but now everything is working fine perfect now we're just gonna have to wait for the next mine shaft there we go. Go ahead and assign that. Guys, I'm going to have to go ahead and end this episode here. If you guys have enjoyed another item miner video, please, guys, go ahead and smash the like button and subscribe so you guys don't miss any more daily content. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.